my fellow peers and potential donors. My name is Liddell Lewis and I'm the founder of the Children in Need Food and Clothing Drive. My mission statement is to make all children feel like young kings and queens. There is nothing like feeling loved, wanted, and appreciated. We can make this dream a reality with your help of donating to our drive. The goal is to gather as many donations as possible for children in both homeless shelters and foster homes. The question I wanted to answer is, do children in foster homes and shelters have enough access to food and clothing during this current pandemic? And what can I do to help? Thanks to the skills I learned in my FIPS course, I was able to figure out what I could do to help by doing something simple within my power that can help make a difference. Even if it's something as simple as giving a few goods. I figured a good way to solve my question was by creating a step-by-step -step simple solution with the use of my business skills. With self-awareness, I was able to identify my desired purpose and mission. With design thinking, I created a plan. With global awareness slash intercultural competence, I was able to pinpoint who I wanted my mission to focus on. With understanding data, I gather research on my topic. With systems thinking, I was able to dig deeper into my data by checking statistics as well as the current events impacting the issue. Lastly, with contemporary media literacy, creating an easy and accessible way to stay informed as well as join in on the contribution. I might not have millions, but what I do have is the belief of sharing. Here is a little background on why I'm so passionate about this drive. I was raised in a family where it's better to give than to receive. My great grandmother, Nellie Laws, was the foster parent for years and she raised over 50 children. She raised them until they were able to either go to a permanent home or until they aged out, meaning they were 18, making them an adult at the time and leaving care without a legal connection to a family. Nonetheless, she always treated them as if they were her own children, not as if they were foster children. First and foremost, the goal of my drive is to help children in their time of need, but I cannot do this alone. There is strength in numbers. There will always be a set location where you'll be able to find the food and clothing drive. You will see our sign as well as our bins with logos on them to let you know which items go where and we will also make you aware of what organizations the donations will be going towards. Whether it is socks, gloves, baby clothes, pampers, maybe even a jacket, a variety of material goods can go a long way for these children. With the food items, we are asking for non-perishable foods such as canned goods, box foods, cereal, cookies, baby formula is also a good option. In addition to this, ways we plan to keep people informed of our drive is by posting flyers, postings on social media, as well as having all of our information posted on our website. On the website, you'll be able to find ways you can become a helper, the locations and its addresses, information for the organization and direct links to their sites where you'll be able to make online cash donations. Without a doubt, this is an act of kindness and goodwill encourages me to reach out to the children in need who aren't able to have such a gracious person in their lives. I believe no child should go without basic needs, whether it's clothing, food, shoes, or even a place they can just feel loved. In conclusion, this is where we can come together and make a difference. With this small selfless act of kindness, with this food and clothing drive, we can give back to the children. There is no donation that is too small or too big. All are welcome. Please give anything that you can. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Due to the current pandemic, I wasn't able to host my food and clothing drive as planned. What I was able to do instead was each week collect donations from friends, family, and neighbors to help still provide donations for children in this crucial time.